Hey everyone, I'm Joel on the road and today my UNESCO World Heritage journey is at the historic old town of Avila in central Spain. Now Avila has one of the longest and most interesting histories in all of Spain. It existed in pre-Roman times though nothing is known about that and not much is known about the Roman period either though it did give the city its current rectangular layout with two main streets crossing in the centre. After the fall of the Roman Empire it became a Visigoth city and then was conquered by the North African Moors. The Christians attacked the city very heavily during the reconquest to the point where there was hardly anything left standing. Eventually it fell and became part of the Christian Empire in the early 11th century. And it, this was pretty much the heyday of the city. It was heavily repopulated and became a very important center. This here is the Cathedral of San Salvador, and it's the main cathedral here in Avila. What's really interesting about it is that the cathedral is actually built into the defensive walls of the city. This big round section behind me is actually the back of the cathedral. So you can really use the cathedral as part of your city defense plan. Behind me is the Basilica of St. Vincent and it's interesting here because this is an extramuros church. It's built outside the city walls. It dates from the 12th century, not long after the Christian reconquest. And there's quite a few big important churches built outside the walls, which might seem strange, but I think it's a real demonstration saying that, you know what, we don't need these walls. We're going to build our churches wherever we want. That's how safe and secure we are in our worship. Behind me is the convent of St. Teresa of Avila, who was born in this courtyard in the early 16th century. Now she was a prominent Spanish writer and a member of the uh, Counter-Reformation, and she was canonized for that in the early 17th century. There's now a convent just behind me that's dedicated to her, and she's one of the town's most famous citizens. Well, that's it from me here at the old town of Avila. The walls are really interesting and they, they look absolutely great, but they're just, they're so well maintained and so clean that they almost look uh, not real, like they're part of an amusement park or something like that. But, oh well, they're still very nice to see. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'm Joel on the road. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you at the next World Heritage site.